three, two, one. Hey, what's, what's going on, guys? Say? It's all of a sudden family here. <laughs> I want to say. <laughs> okay, again. What are you? What are we saying again? Hey, what's going on, guys? It's all of a sudden family here. Okay. <laughs> three, two, one. Hey, hey what's, what's going, going on, on guys? guys? It's, it's all, all of a sudden, sudden family, family here. here. <laughs> that wasn't scripted at all. Family nope. here. Today is our business meeting Monday. Officially, it's Wednesday. <laughs> to say what officially it's wednesday but we're going to start late. doing business meetings on monday and what? that's what this playlist is going to be about business decisions and right now we're going to dive into allocating jobs this is my wife they know that already you but if they haven't seen our videos if this have. is the first one they're seeing let's let them know who we are you this dying piece is just not going to be with you just to make videos they're going to know i'm your wife okay this is my wife, Diana. Since she doesn't want to do introduction, I'll introduce her myself. It's her name is Diana. She is 29 years old. She no, is... I am not. I will be next month. I'm still 28. Let's keep that there. She will be on the market for open value as soon as October the 1st, 2020. You can email me for more information at... <laughs> I'm just kidding. Bro. <laughs> You're dead ass. Okay. It's your boy Kyle. I'm here with my wife Diana today. Say hello. Hi guys. She can talk on her own. I don't have to tell <laughs> her when to talk. But <laughs> okay, good. All right. So this is our business meeting Mondays and we're going to be talking about business decisions here on this playlist. So um, this might be the first video that you see, but in the future you'll see a couple more videos and it's going to be my input on what I feel business decisions to be like. Um, you know, myself, I've started my own business. I've started a couple of businesses, um, some successful, some straight failures, but you always lead to another one when you're in that role of entrepreneurship. But you always gotta have a good supportive backbone with you at all times. And if you don't, I pray for you, my brother. Anyways, so, this is the first video in this playlist and if you hear the kids in the background they're they're hanging out they're doing their little downtime right now in, the, in their bedrooms um we're at the kitchen counter which is our kind office of right now room yeah it's like a, a mixture it's a nice little island anyways so right now we're doing allocation diana is going to talk about what she is going to control in the business and i'm going to talk about what i'm going to control in the business that way we can merge and come together but right now we need to allocate decide on who's going to do what and what roles are inside the business so what are you thinking so far for a business name like what like in so for our channel we're all of a sudden family mm -hmm. What do you see fit for we a business name? Keep that name. Just keep that name? Yeah. When people Google all of a sudden. Family. Family. It's yeah. going to be, everything's going to fall under that category. You don't want to make a business name with something else. Yeah. It's just ain't going to be right. I'm thinking just like that too. Whenever somebody types in all of a sudden on Google, they should pull up, you Everything. know, our YouTube channel. Yeah. They should see like our blog, our website, our links, our social media, something like that in that aspect. I think that's a good idea. So what my thought was all of a sudden family productions. That way, anything that we do will fall under all of a sudden family productions, whether it's media, merchandise, advertisement blogs whatever whatever we decide to do within this family it can fall under a production company one name one thing yeah be different branches basically you know like we have five have kids have multiple streams of income mm -hmm. it's always about that mm -hmm. so as far as the marketing goes between me and you who would have a better chance and more control on putting the market stuff out there? Me. You think you would? Mm -hmm. Why? Because. Because why? 
I just, I think that I would because I have an eye for that. Like I, 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 yes. Cause I think just, I would. I'm really good at the background stuff that involves editing and descriptioning and marketing and analytics, all that stuff where you look at this word title versus this word title, which word stronger in the Google search engine and I guess so apply would. that. I guess so. I guess so. So when we come to, okay, that job description itself will be both of us. Yes, it'd be both of us when it comes down to it. But the person who needs to be responsible for making sure a titling is done. Let's write this down. That's what we need to do. We're going to write it down. Because if we don't write it down, we're not going to know what we're talking about. And guys, write down, do a vision board, do, write it down. You write it down and I believe I put it in my Bible and I write down what you pinpoint what you want out of life and you write it down and you put it in your Bible or you put it in like a safe key box or you sleep with it under your pillow or you pin it to your uh, ceiling. Remember that stuff that you write down always comes true. I've seen it time and time again. I'm kind of being a hypocrite because I haven't done it in a while, but I'm going to do one as soon as I get off of here because I have something that I want to write down so it can come true. Um, speaking it into existence, yes, that works. I believe in that. But I feel like if you write it down and you put it somewhere and at the end of the year, you're so caught up in life that at the end of the year, you go see what you wrote down and you feel so good about yourself when you see that what you wrote down has actually happened and you actually did it without even noticing that you're doing it you know but if it's something big you're gonna notice but if it's something little like lose 10 pounds or lose 20 pounds and you do it without really noticing that you're doing it within like two or three months you go check your vision board and then you're just like oh my gosh like let me add something else to it let me say i want to lose 50 pounds or i want to lose 10 more pounds and it just it's really cool like my husband he has ideas about tools and just everything and he will always tell me and I wouldn't as soon as he told me literally within like 24 hours or two two to three days somebody came up with the idea they patented it and then they ran with it so I've been telling him write it down write it down write it down get a little notebook write it down and one day he'll be able to come make one of his ideas come true exactly it will all right, so for this job title, um, like you know how you go on Indeed.com or something like that, you search for jobs in their description. Like if you didn't know a job existed out there, let's say it's cabinet maker or whatever. Like carpentry. A, a corporate title would probably be, you know, carpenter, you know, cabinet engineer or something like that where it has that specific description that's what this job we're going to call it the title executive and the job will be to one handle titles and two um description let's see let's write it down titles titles descriptions what else keywords And what else? Click bait. So the title executive will be responsible for titles, descriptions, keywords, and click bait. And that, put a KL. Well, let's rock, <laughs> paper, scissor it. Oh, you know I'm gonna win. I'm gonna have to do that. Okay, crap. let's do it. You ready? Rock, rock paper, paper, scissor. <laughs> you ready? Hold on. Okay. Close your eyes. Because you be cheating. You do. I'm not. Bleep. You ready? I'm ready. You say it then. You say you it. You say it. You close your eyes. You say it. Close your eyes first. Quit looking at my boobs. 
Close your eyes. Are you closing your eyes? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Go. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I won. Why'd you do that? You had your eyes open. <laughs> okay, okay. I'll right. No, no, no. I'll close my eyes. Let's be, let's be for real. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. All right. No, I don't want it. <laughs> no, you don't want it? I don't want it. All right, I'll, I'll be responsible for this. So, so this is what we're doing. Scam likely. We are, I don't know if you guys can see mm. this. I don't know how to do this. Okay, here we go, boom, right there. All right, so if you can see that, job allocation, all of a sudden production, first job would be title executive. And basically their description is down below. So, I'll Ooh. sign my name to this. I don't mind doing that, I'm analytical. I like doing research. Now, that's a title job. What other job is there in this production? Editing. An editor, okay. So we would call it film, because this is not just any editing. Film, editor. And what job will a film editor do? I don't know. What job will a film editor do? Edit the do? videos that we shoot. Edit the videos. Edit Come videos. up with ideas for the video. Download videos, mm -hmm. transfer videos, upload videos, and share videos. Yeah. So the film editor will do edit videos, downloads, transfer videos, upload videos, mm -hmm. save videos, mm -hmm. share videos, whatever it has to do with moving a video around. The person that does that will be, you know, responsible for that. You can't do it. You don't know how to run a computer. Since I got the first job, you think it's fair for you to get the second job? Yes. Okay. Sign your name to it. Wait, I put hand sanitizer on Corona. <laughs> Wait, I don't know where you've been with your hands. You went to school today and everything. Sana, Sana, Sana. Okay, so sign my name. Y'all, my signature is the best. Stop! Don't show them that! Uh, you're so rude! She signed it. I signed it. Okay, that's two job titles so far. And obviously, like, the older our kids get, the more responsibilities that they can take into the family business. And they're gonna have their own channel, too. Yeah, and at the same time, be able to hire somebody later on when it comes to, we'll you know... We'll be blessed. Yeah, obviously. Alright, the next job title, what would it be? <laughs> Content. Content creator. Yes. Okay. I don't came up with all two of them already. You're next. Don't come at me like that. The like, thing is, I'm trying list, to get you to answer. I already know all these. A list. Uh, the first one would be a Q and A about us, creator. how we met. Content creator. What does a content creator do? Um, they come up with content like what to do, like mukbang, Q and A. Key ideas. Um, yeah, so that should be both of us. We should initially, we should both come up. The kids should come up with something. Um, that should be the entire family. Yes, everybody. So everybody. Everybody. Signs here. We go first. Because we created we the family. Sign there. Um, I gotta show this to my lawyer because I don't feel Call like- Call him up. But I don't feel like I should sign second. Like we should be on the same line. That is the same. It's That's the same not the subsection. same line. You above me and no. See, this is why you gotta pick your battles. She's talking about this is not the same. It's that literally, ain't. this is a subsection. We're in the same section. Hello. You say we in the same section. Anyways. We're not. What did you go get? We me? got three job titles so far. The fourth okay, title will be Analyzer. You haven't put hand sanitizer on this whole video. Analyzer. Analyzer? That should be all. That's all. That's literally your name. 
analyzing is your name. All right, so an analyzer does all of the back end work, keeping up with numbers, doing the numbers. Money me. An analyzer will suggest ideas to the title executive, yeah. which is me. You were. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure that the film editor produces videos on time yes. to upload to the market, which is you. So how many videos are we gonna do a day? One? I think on average you should have about three videos going up a week. I thought you were gonna say a day. I'm like, Damn. no. Three videos a day Shower? would be too hard, especially trying to manage a family. We have five kids, two adults. I have six kids. She considers me a kid every time. This gets old. I guess I should put in here under film editor, on time. When people on YouTube yes. upload a video on schedule, like you expect to tune in and watch their videos on, you know, every Thursday, every second Thursday of the month. Like we have Coffee Talk Tuesdays. We need to make sure our coffee talks are uploaded on Tuesdays, right? By a certain time. That way, when people log in, whatever, they just wanna check us out on Tuesdays, they know that we do coffee talks and our videos will be uploaded on Tuesdays, Tuesday morning. First thing we do, upload that video, it sinks in, do it Wednesday night, or Monday night. Do it Monday night. Scheduler. What? You. No, that's you. I can't do schedules. You know I can't. What is that? What is a schedule? What's a corporate word for a scheduler? Planner. Event operations manager. That's it right there. Event. I get way too excited for that kind of stuff. Isn't that weird? Yeah. I don't. I follow him. His excitement is the best. Besito. Kiss. Events. Besito. Ooh, somebody stank it, boy. He pooped. I gotta go change it. Stank it, stank it, stank it. You hear? <laughs> you smelled yourself? Show them your mad face. Show them your mad face. So, right here. Right look, there. Look, look at look, the camera. Look. Show my face. Mad face. Show your mad face. <laughs> Show them your mad face. Go. Go, do it. Every time you try to get one of my kids to do something on camera, she loves her daddy. She gave you one back. All right, let's go change it. All right. I'm all alone. I'm left without you. You know I can't do without you. Event planner manager. Event planning manager. Planning. I'll sign off on that. So I got one, two, three, four rolls. You got two so far. Is that <sighs> operations manager? That's it. Okay. Are you okay with that title? I feel like I'm just coming up with yes, this. Yes, 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 yes. Operations yes. manager? Yes. Okay. I answer to emails, stuff like that. Operations manager, what does it do? See, we're manifesting this. In the near future, honey, I'm gonna be so backed up and answering people that we just... That yeah. we don't have to hire somebody. What does it do? Uh, emails, phone calls. Answers. Because your girl speaks two Questions languages. Questions. Spanish. And answers. And English. Questions and answers. Emails. Responses. You handle all the responses. Sign that. Sign there, please. She didn't try to mix it. <laughs> <laughs> DLS. Ma'am, I need you to sign this. That, I, I need you to sign this, that's not your full name. DLS initials is not going to cut it, okay? Thank you. 
smile while you're doing it. Okay, so we got title executive, film editor, content creator, analyzer, event planning manager, operations manager. Anything else that we are missing inside the production overall? No. You think that's it? I feel like that's a lot. Okay. I here by declare this a thumb war. <laughs> the rights and responsibilities of my job, title, and description. You want to sound the same line? I don't even know what you I don't even know what you said. It's going to work. Give me that. Stop. What did I say? 8 26, 2020. And I'll make a kid sign below that. All right, now we will agree to have meetings <laughs> on Monday to see what we're going to produce into the market for the week, what goals we need to hit. That way, an analyzer can keep track and grow the channel, grow the business, all that. Content creators, as all of us, we're going to come up with like marketing ideals, um, merchandise out there. Everything that we basically need to grow our YouTube channel, which is also our YouTube business, then we'll all come together and do that. So, as of this being the first business operations meeting, meeting allocations comes to adjourn. Is adjourned. We have came up with all the titles for the business which is something that you definitely have to do when you start a business you got to come up with one a business plan how you're going to serve somebody what are you going to do what are you going to put out there so people can do business with you two who's going to be in control of everything if you're just you you're going to be control of everything but when you try and do something together or as a family or a partner it doesn't matter. You got to come up with the allocations for who's going to take care of what. If you don't, you're not able to build trust in one another. You're not able to say, okay, you're going to be in control of all the film editing. You're going to be responsible for. It gets mixed up. You can always go back to this and be like, no, you said you were going to do this. And it's kind of builds your relationship with your spouse too because we're holding each other accountable for what we signed on here. You know? That's it. So, like, you tell me one day i'm just like ah oh, just don't feel like doing anything and you're like no we had an agreement you know like we have to do this to be able to have a future for our five kids because it's hard putting five kids to college honey you know mm -hmm. so we kind of want to give them a base so when they go to college or they decide when they leave the house so they can have a little money in their pocket because we started off with nothing and it was very hard yeah. i want to be able to do for my kids what didn't get done for us exactly. as growing up you know because it's very hard so. And I think all parents would want that for the kids. Yes. Especially when you come from a torn apart, I would say. I mean, I don't want to be like, what you, know, you know, no, it's not bad. It's just like, there's such a thing called politically correct, but I don't think it matters when you're coming from here. Like, if it's your experience, how you grew up as a child, that's how you grew up. But you would obviously want something better for your child if there is anything better. If you had everything, glamour and all that, it may be hard to live up to that. And shame on your parents. Yep. So my kids, it don't matter how much money, like we're pretty well off right now. We're like happy we're, you know, middle class is what I want to call it. But it took a long time to get here. Yeah. You know, so like. Don't get me wrong, my kids are going to have everything they need. But if they want something, they're going to have to work for it like we did. But we're going to be able to provide that for them instead of them going and asking other people or having to do other things and struggle, you know? That's so. the whole reason for the allocation because our kids are going to have chore responsibilities. They've always had chore responsibilities. Yep. They're going to have business responsibilities. And then at the same time, they'll learn from this. That way, in the future, when they have a family, when they have a business or a job, they know their responsibilities are within their guidelines. And sometimes you do have to step over and help somebody accomplish a deadline if they have one. And hopefully that's not the case because, you know, you want the person responsible for it to be able to take care of it. But with that being said, that really. All right, guys. Catch you guys on the next video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. My baby's crying. I gotta go. I don't know if you're gonna stay. I gotta go too. I got some things to take care of. Make sure that this goes in writing and put up somewhere. Get the lawyers to check it out. That way, if she tries it. No, I'm just kidding. Well, lawyers. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Again, thank you so much for being with us. Um, like she said, don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit the bell notifications. Please share our content. We are really trying to grow this channel. We are a family, a beautiful family. We like to share with you guys. Um, if you have any suggestions for us 
let us know in the comments below reach out to us our email will be somewhere i think she's in control of that now so don't forget we're here for you um anything that we can do let us know and i appreciate you guys love you all of a sudden family we out